Tonight, we have our first Friday night fishing tournament of the year. It is a three fish tournament. All of the fish have to be 14 inches and there's gonna be a lot of big fish caught. We're gonna go out here, see if we can beat these guys and take their money. Stay tuned. You guys, pretty good little crowd out here today. Not bad at all. This is what a shotgun start looks like right here. <laughs> Usually whenever I fish this lake, I run all the way up to the dam first thing. That's where I have all my confidence at. But today I just had a feeling that I should start over here on this area. And turns out that there's nobody that wanted to come over here. So this is where we're starting out at right here. I love fishing this lake. It's been very good to me in the past. Hoping it's going to be good to me today. We'll see. Already see a fish up there on the on the scope i need to get my net out because when i catch them here they are not going to be small they are going to be large and i'm by myself so having a net would definitely be nice already got the fairy wand tangled up all right let's see what we can get going here We've got four hours to catch three fish. And they've gotta be over 14 inches. There's the first one of the day right there. Not sure how big it is, but it's a bass. I don't think it's huge, but it should keep. It should be a 14. Yeah, yeah. You might be a little keep a bass. I don't know if he's gonna make it or not, but we're gonna check him and see. All right, stop that. Stop that. Stop that. Nope. He's a little bit short, so we're tossing him back. We don't have time to waste on those little tiny bass. We need big old bass. He was a slimy sucker too, let me tell you. Let me tell you, he was slimy. But hey, first fish of the day, can't complain about that. Within the first like three minutes. I will take it all day long, baby. All day. We gotta find some bigger ones than that though, for sure. I'm not gonna stay here for too much longer if it ain't gonna hit on much. I don't wanna waste my time. So I'm just throwing a drop shot around right now. This is a really clear lake. I'm not in super clear water right now, but the drop shot usually tends to work pretty good out here just because of the way that the lake sets up. But I'm not getting a ton, a ton of interest. So I did catch that fish and we may come back here later to check the spot, but as of right now, it's not hitting on much, so we're moving. We're going to see if we can get some fish. I think they're going to be fired up here in the next hour, so that's what I'm kind of hoping for. Well, I hope you guys are enjoying the video so far. If you are enjoying it, be sure to leave a like on it. And while you're down there, be sure to go ahead and subscribe to the channel for me as well. I am trying to hit 100,000 subscribers by the end of the year, and we are well on our way. So if you wouldn't mind doing that, it would help me out a ton. I greatly appreciate it. Let's go ahead and get back into the fishing. All right, I'm going to throw me a drop shot right here and a spoon and a couple other baits. We're going to see what we can get. But those are going to be my two key baits for right now. There's a fish. That's a nice fish too. He's a pretty good one, I think. Should be a keeper. No, well, maybe not. He's just fighting like crazy. 
You just fight me, ain't you? I don't think he's gonna keep. Got him. Stay on there. Stay on there. Nice. Oh no. Yes. Nice fish. Not bad. That'll work. All right, that was about a three pounder. Good fish on a spoon. There's a lot of fish that stay around this bridge, but I'm trying to make sure that I get bit from a big one, not a small one, because I could sit here with a drop shot all day and catch dinks, but I want to catch big ones. Four pounders is what we need. There's a fish, dink. See, that's what I'm saying. Throw something like this and you'll probably catch a lot of small fish, but you throw something like a spoon, you're gonna be catching bigger fish. That's just how it goes. It's fun to catch fish, but when you're in a tournament, you can't afford to be wasting time catching one pounders when you need four pounders. That's the whole thing. Another baby. Another baby. Yeah, they wouldn't bite.
on your noggin. That's a good fish. That's a good one. I think he's a 14. Yeah. He should make it. Should. He ain't even really as good as I thought he was, but. He's a 14, barely. Barely. Barely, barely, barely. But he'll make the cut for right now. But he ain't gonna make it for very long. But there's two fish. That fish I just caught was fighting way harder than his size. But they're known to do that out here. They just fight like crazy. Yo, how did that happen? How? That is so weird. Unless it was a jack. Must have been a jack. All right, well, it just broke off on a fish, but it just like totally just clean cut it. And there is jacks in here and they have some big old teeth. I think that's probably what it was. That's probably what it was, the way it felt and everything. Probably a good thing I didn't hook it because if I did, I'd think I was winning the tournament because those things are pretty big. But we got to get us a four pounder, dude. That's what I need is a dang four. There's another one. This is a keeper. This is a good fish. Should be. Oh yeah. This should be a good one. Hopefully this is our kicker for the night. Not really sure how big it is, but it's feeling like it could be a three or a four. I'm hoping. Nope, don't you jump, don't you jump, don't you jump. It's a good fish. Come on. Be a five pounder. Be a five pounder. 
please. Oh, it ain't a five pounder, but it's a good one. He's about a two and a half, three, I think. It's kind of hard for me to even see him right now with all these clouds. There we go. Not a bad fish, not a giant by any means, but good three pounder. Good three pounder. I'll take it. I will take it. It's been a struggle tonight getting them to bite. Getting them to bite good. That one did like he was supposed to, but they have not been feeding very good, but now maybe they're gonna start feeding a little bit more with this low light condition we're having because the sun is starting to set. That is a big one. Please be there. Yes. Begging. Or he felt like he was at first. He's not even big. You sucker. I don't even know if he's even 14. I've got my three fish limit, but I don't think he's gonna help. It ain't worth the time. I'm just gonna throw him back. Just gonna throw him back. Try to catch another one that's bigger. Try to catch a big one. Cause right now we're catching dinks. I need four pounders. It is 740, we have our three fish limit, but we need to keep culling because I do not have a ton of weight right now. So it's kind of the game plan right now. We're trying to cull up with some bigger fish. All right, I'm moving. I need a change. I need to see a new setting. Wrong rod. This is the rod I want. It's you, bruh. All right, we just moved spots. We're gonna try this little hole right here. The fish are biting a little bit better now, but they're still not biting great. That's a good one. Hope it's a bass. I think it is. Yeah, it's a nice one. It's a nice one. My reel is sounding terrible. Ah, oh, dude, I caught a jack. That gummit. Yep, that's what I was afraid of. I said, I hope it's a bass. Guess what? It was not a bass. One of these stupid toothy summer guns. Definitely gonna retie my drop shot after that. Oh yeah, eat it, eat it. I think this is a good one. I hope. It's fighting like a good one. Come on, please be a four pounder. I need a four pounder really bad. Come on. 
Come on. It ain't no four, but he'll call out that other one I've got. That's for sure. It'll call it out. We got a decent bag now, but we definitely don't have a winning bag in my mind. But not a bad fish. He's not even a true three. He's like a two and a half, probably. Really know how big this one is but I think it's a pretty good one hopefully bigger than one of my other ones hopefully nope he's just a fighter Well, I'm not catching bad fish. It's not like they're like dinks, but they're just not big enough for out here. Out here, you gotta have four pounders. And I have not ran into one yet. Be nice if y'all could eat it all the way. I'd greatly appreciate that. Another good one. Should be. Not sure how good, but it's another good one. Yeah, he's pretty good. He might call something. I don't really know. He's kind of skinny. He's kind of skinny. All right, we're going to fish this little point right here. Let's see what we can get. See if there's any bass that want to play around. This is a good one. This is the biggest one of the day, I think. 
I think this is the biggest one of the day. Yeah, definitely is. This is a nice fish right here, guys. This is a big one. Don't you jump. Don't you come up and jump. Don't you do that. Don't you do that. Please be a bass. It's a bass. It's a dang good one. I don't know how good, but I just saw it. It's a bass. Oh, I hooked it in the side of the mouth. That's why it feels so dang big. Oh, man. That gummit. I don't know if he's going to help me or not. I really don't know. I do not need you. I need your grandfather. All right, y'all, it's gonna be pretty hard for you to see now, but we're on our last spot of the day. It's 9, 10, but I'm just gonna finish out here because this is where I have the most confidence. So that's what we're gonna do. See if we can get on some fish. I gotta get a couple different rods out, but we're gonna see if we can get on some other fish. Like I said, she's dark. I'm gonna throw a black spinnerbait around and a couple topwater lures and see what I can catch. And hopefully, we'll end up culling again. If I hook up, I'll turn my light on, but I'm not gonna use it for right now. All right, that's it, y'all. We're wrapping it up. I don't wanna be late to weigh in, so I'm gonna go ahead and leave. It's like 9.47. Make sure I've got plenty of time to get back. Let's see what we've got. I don't think we've got enough to win. I don't even think we've got enough to place, but we're about to find out. All right. Wait a minute. Oh, that's bad. Huh? That's bad. Yeah. All of my they ain't bad. No. But Definitely ain't gonna win though. I'll tell you that right now. No, I ain't got a big one. They're all about this size. Thank you, sir. All right, 8.15. Definitely not enough to win. A guy in front of me weighed in like 9, 11 or something like that. He had a real big one, but... There they go. All right, and that is a wrap on the tournament. Hope you guys enjoyed all of that fishing footage. I ended up with 8 pounds, 15 ounces. So one ounce away from 9 pounds. I knew the whole time that I had all three pounders. And out there, it usually takes around 12 pounds or better to win, but I'm not gonna complain about catching three pounders. I caught quite a few of them, and I uh, also caught a lot of just two pounders, just really good fish. So that's always fun when you're reeling those in, especially on a spinning rod. They fight good, and it's a good time just going out there, messing around and fishing. This is a $20 fishing tournament, it's $20 per person, so it's really not much money involved. You just go out there, have some fun. If you win, you win. If you don't, you don't. And uh, congratulations to the guys that did place. I think first place had 12 pounds and some change. Second place was 11 pounds and some change. Third place was 10 pounds and some change. So like I was saying the whole video, I need some four pounders. I need some four pounders. I knew if I had three, four pounders, I would be doing pretty good. And that's about what it took. But the guys who did win had a big fish of 714. So they didn't have all four pounders. They had one almost eight. But I'll pop up the weights right here. That way you guys can see what first, second, and third was. And before I get off here, I did want to let you guys know that I also have another tournament video that is going to be dropping either later this week or next week. So be on the lookout for that. We've got a lot more cool content coming out very soon. If you want to check out another tournament video while you wait for the new one to drop, I will leave one right here for you to look at. And there's also some linked in the description down below. A dub out.